What is going on guys, BCD here, and today I just wanted to bring you a quick review of the HyperX Cloud Alpha Pro headset. Um, just recently picked this up from GangStop, just wanted to give you my um, thoughts and review of their product from HyperX. So starting off pretty much, I want to start about build quality, and man, is it great. This is a great product, great build quality. That whole aluminum body makes it very durable very sturdy doesn't really give you any dings or anything like that you don't have to worry about your um, your bands breaking or anything like that this is a very durable device the sound is great the quality is great they just add, updated their quality on the sound so it really has a lot of a lot more clarity than my last previous headset um, I had the hyper X cloud I believe just the hyper X clouds for quite a while had it for about three years and things were great one reason that I'm really getting these now is because the shorted out on me because I kept dropping my controller and I felt like it was my fault. I wasn't really their fault. It was user error. So it definitely is. It lives up to the build quality as they state. The braided cables, everything that comes along with this package is just A1 spot on with that durability, with that build quality. Moving over to sound. Sound sounds great. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to oversell these headsets. It's like a really good headset, but the sound is perfect for, I mean, I mean of course you're going to get better sound going somewhere else. Maybe if you buy, pay like $400, $500, but for the sound and the price point that this thing is asking, the quality that they're asking, it's just really a great headset all around. The quality is clear, crisp, and guaranteed you're going to hear some footsteps behind you. You're going to hear whatever something's happening on a game. You're going to hear it. Moving on to that mic, it muffles out sound. You don't, everything isn't heard. What your voice, your voice is going to go through, not everything else. So definitely helps when muffling out your background noise. Um, definitely can hear people well. You can hear, they can hear you well. I haven't had any complaints about me sounding low or not clear. So it's definitely one of those headsets. Definitely a great one for gaming and pretty much what it's built for. Um, once again, I'm talking about them braided cables being detachable. I didn't like the HyperX Clouds because it wasn't detachable. This one fixed that problem for me. That was the only thing I really didn't like about it is that I couldn't pull out the cord and just go replace it. If something was to happen to it, um, they do give you braided cords. And uh, as I say, that I shorted out my jump, dropping my controller too many times and yanking on it a few different times. So maybe if it was detachable, I'd probably be still using those. But it definitely isn't the quality. It isn't the sound that went away. It was just really a sort in my cord so now that it's detachable definitely works a lot better for me and it's really strong when you stick it in there so it's not like it's going to be come flying out if you um accidentally do anything or step on it or something like that the thing is like really strong it's like these little pins in it it's like these pins that grip grab onto the aux cable and it really holds it in there real tight another pro about this thing is obviously that price point being starting off at a hundred dollars and it's just a really good, it's, it's, it's worth the $100, no, hands down, definitely. Um, it's just a really good headset. I, I really felt like the HyperX Cloud is still worth $70, but this one is worth 100 in my opinion, just because of the build quality. You know, the, the last standing I had with this company, the clarity that I'm getting now, the detachability, the build quality, the cushions. I mean, they didn't do much to progress it, but at the same time, they didn't have to do much for me to be one to pay $100 for the last one. And I only end up paying like 60 for that one. So this one definitely is still worth 100 to me. That one was worth 100 Just got it for 60 I mean, this this is just a really good headset. If you haven't guessed it by now, I really highly recommend these um, headsets to anybody that's looking for a new gaming headset. Anyone's looking to upgrade from an old one or just looking for a good sound um, headset all around, this is their... This isn't going to be the, I guess, it, in my opinion, it's the one all meets all because it it hits every box for me. I mean, it might not hit every box for you. Some people need Bluetooth. Some people need um, additional features. Some people need all that type of stuff. I don't need that. What I'm using my head, gaming headset for is to literally talk to people while I play games. So I don't really need it for anything else. If I wanted to use something else like that, I pick up some sony bluetooth headphones which i have i don't really care for that stuff when i'm gaming because that's what i'm doing i'm gaming i just need something that's going to keep me in the game keep me focused and let me hear everything that's going on around me and these cut these are definitely worth it in that hundred dollars aspect so 
Highly recommend them. Pick them up on Amazon. Pick them up at GameStop. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have for you guys. If you like this commentary, don't forget to like and subscribe. I want to thank you again. And as always, peace.